So I'm going to move on to Bab Samia. This is the Bab that we are supposed to do today. So Bab Samia, <clears throat> this is our fail. Madi, you, you can see that in Madi, what's going to happen? So far, we have Bab Nasara. We did uh, Bab uh, Daraba and we did Bab Fataha. All these three Babs in Madi, they were having Fatha, right? But this is the first clan we are learning today, which is taking Kasra on the middle root letter in Madi. So Samia, and now what's gonna happen when it go to Mudariya? It is going to take Fatha. This mean, which has Kasra in Madi, in uh, Mudariya, it is taking Fatha. So Samia become yes ma'u. So, so Samia, yes ma'u, and the master would be Sam'an. Fahua, Sami'un. Sumi'a, yus ma'u, Sam'an, Fahua, Masmu'un. Then, um, Al Amru Minhu Isma Manahianhu La Tasma and Zarfu Minhu is Masma Un Masmi Un Masma Tun. And we discussed that why three patterns, right? Last class. So Masma Un, when we have uh, in Fail Mudaria, we have uh, A and U sound, which is Bab Nasara and Bab Fataha. Then we use this kind, this master, sorry, this uh, zarf. And when we have uh, other uh, uh, bab, which is dara uh, bayat uh, so e sound. And what is the other one? Samia, uh, no, Samia has a sound. Hasiba uh, yasibu. Yeah, Hasiba Yasibu. So the, uh, then uh, when it is having Kasra in uh, Mudaria, then it is going to take Kasra in, uh, in the pattern or in Zerf. And then Mas Ma'atun, why this uh, Ta Marbuta at the end? This is for Mubaliwa. When something is a lot, then we are going to use this Zerf. Then we have Mis Ma'un. This is uh, our Isam Ala meaning tool out of it. So mismaun could be like your uh, he hearing aids, right? So this can be mismaun, mismaatun, and mismaun. So these are the three patterns for uh, isam ala over here. Now this samia, I put some practice words over here. So fariha, this is another uh, way to say samia. So fariha, and these are all the bab of Samia. So you can do practice with that, okay? Then we have uh, why it always go other way. Okay. So now we have Hasiba. Hasiba again uh, look like uh, same uh, in uh, our uh, Madi, it is taking E sound, right? Hasiba. But in Mudaria, it is still taking E sound. So Hasiba, Yahsibu. So Hasiba, it is rhyming with Samia in Madi, but Mudaria is different. So Yahsibu. Then Hisaban, Fahua, Hasibun. Husiba, Yuhsabu, Hisaban, Fahua, Mahsubun. Al Amru Minhu, Ihsib. Wanahianhu la tahsib, wazarfuanhu, mahsabun, mahsibun, and mahsabatun. And then uh, some ala is mihsabun, mihsabatun, and mihsabun. So this is how Bab Sami, uh, so, uh, sorry, Bab Hasiba work. Then next we have uh, Bab Karuma, which is our last clan. So Karuma. Uh, has U sound. So far, we do not have any clan that was taking U sound on the middle root letter. Right? So this is the unique about this Karuma. And when it comes to Mudaria, it becomes Yakrumu. 
Yakrumu is like Yansuru. So in Mudariya, it is going to rhyme with Bab Nasara. So Karuma, Yakrumu, Karamatan, Vakaraman. So it's going to take two uh, masters. Fahua, Karimun, Fa'ilun. So this uh, Fa'ilun pattern uh, are derived from Karuma uh, clan. <clears throat> then uh, you notice that there is no passive for that. So uh, Amar would be Ukrum, Vanahi Anhu, La Takrum, and Zarfu Anhu, Mak Ramun, Mak Rimun, Mak Ramatun. And then uh, Allah is Mik Ramun, Mik Ramatun, Mik Ramun. Again, this Karuma, you can practice with these words, okay? Sorry, I don't have any energy to practice today, so you're gonna do it by yourself. And now let's see how they look like when they, uh, like, uh, if we put them together. So let's see what's going on. So you can see that Nasara uh, Daraba Fataha all having a, a sound, right? All fathas in Madi. Then we have Sami'a Hasiba. So they are having in the middle root letter, Kasra. So Sami'a and Hasiba, they are kind of matching with each other. And then Karuma, I told you this is kind of uh, uh, different because it's not matching with any of this clan. Then we have, uh, if we go to Mudaria, then we have Yadribu and Yahsibu. So they are kind of overlapping or matching. Yadribu and Yahsibu. But we should know this is Bab Daraba and this is Bab Hasiba. Then Yaftahu and Yasmau. So they are overlapping. So Yaftahu and Yasmau. Fataha and then Sami'a. In their uh, Madi were different. Then Yansuru and Yakrumu. So they are overlapping. So now how we can kind of solve that problem. So it says over here that uh, if you are confused between Sami'a and Hasiba, because both are having E sound, then the family uh, always win is what? And the Samiya family wins, meaning Samiya family is more frequent in Quran -e Pak than Hasiba. So if you are confused between these two, then you need to go for Bab Samiya and then you can consult the dictionary. Okay, then if you have a problem between Hasiba and Yadribu, so you're gonna go to Daraba because Daraba is more frequent than uh, Yasibu. Then if you have toss between Yansuru and Yakrumu, then you're gonna go for Bab Nasara because this is mostly used. Karuma is very less used in Quran -e Pak. Okay, so these, these are few clues. You can kind of figure them out. And now the same thing I mentioned over here, that Nasara, Yansuru, what is happening? The U sound on the Ain Kalma. And that we are calling that Bab Nasara. Okay, in dictionary, you're going to see the Noon written over there. Then Bab Daraba, you will see Dad written over there. And then what should come to your head? That Ain Kalma has E sound. Fataha Yaftahu, you should know that Fa Kal and this is our Bab Fataha and Ain Kalma is having A sound over here. Then group two is our Samia, Yasmau, and our Ain Kalma has A sound in Mudaria. When I'm saying that, I meant Mudaria, right? Hasiba, Hasiba Yahsabu and uh, Hasiba Yahsibu. 
Okay, these are two uh, options we have for Hasiba. You should keep that in our uh, mind. Okay. So, Hasiba Yah Yahsabu or Hasiba Yahsibu. These are two options for that. And then Karuma Yakrumu. We have U sound and that is all by itself. It's not overlapping. Um, in Madi, but in Mudaria, it is overlapping with uh, Bab Nasara. <coughs> Okay, then over here, the same thing uh, is shown in a kind of poster. So what does that say? This is uh, created by uh, uh, Dasif. So what he used to say? He used to say, Fathu Dammin. Fathu Dammin mean in Bab, in um, Madi, we have Fatha, but in Mudaria, it is taking Dhamma. So this is the song he used to sing to teach us uh, all the uh, kind of how to remember the, these uh, six clans. So this is how you used to go. Fathu Dhammin Nasarayan Suru Fathu Kasrin Dharabaya Duribu Fathatani, Fathatani mean Fataha Yaftahu. So Fathatani mean two Fathas. So both are having Fathas, even in Madi and even in Mudaria. Then Dhammudam mean, what is Dhammudam mean? mean? That uh, in Madi it has Dhamma on the middle root letter, and even when it turns into Mudaria, it's still Dhamma is there. So dhammu dhammin karuma yakrumu. Then kasru fatihin. What does that mean? So kasru, like it has kasra. And then fatihin, it has fatha in mudariya. So if you can remember that song, uh, that would help you guys. Okay, so one more time how it will go. Fathu dam min nasara yan suru. Fathu kasirin daraba yaduribu. Fathatani. Fathatani. Fataha yaftahu. Dammu dam min karuma yakrumu. Kasru fathim samia yasmau. Okay, and you can notice that uh, Hasiba Yahsibu is uh, missed over here, right? So there are five clans. Reason because Samia Yasmau is, I think, very less used. So that's why I was not able to find a lot of practice for that. And even it's not mentioned here. <clears throat> okay, then uh, last class, uh, Alhamdulillah, I was able to uh, explain all that why we are having t three different kind of uh, uh, zarf uh, uh, over here, right? So this is the same thing repeating here. And uh, then we have some practice over here. I already put uh, some words and uh, their bab over here. So, uh, and uh, you need a dictionary for that, right? So I have uh, some practice uh, work over here. You're gonna pick, uh, you, like you're gonna open the dictionary and you are going to find their bab, what bab is it? And most likely these are uh, uh, mostly family one. So you're gonna find what clan is it and uh, you're gonna do surf uh, severe of these clans. So inshallah, they're gonna help you recognize all these bab. So that ends our session. Alhamdulillah. Subhanak Allahumma wa bihamdika. Nashadu an la ilaha illa anta wa nastaghfiruka wa natubu ilayk. Subhana rabbika rabbil izzati amma yasifuna. Wassalamun alal mursaleen. Walhamdulillahi rabbil alameen.